pollution, pollution, pollution. It's the only solution for survival on the planet Earth is a revolution against pollution. It's like all, all, the, all the animals are running this way and a lion comes on a picture, they all run that way. All the animals are all divided all up, all the people are out there playing all these games. A bigger fear comes, they all get together and they all run in one direction. The, the peace plan is uh, that Schultz and all them guys are playing in the Middle East. It doesn't have any fear in it. It doesn't mean anything. It's a bunch of fucking old assholes talking about old rhetoric. Well, you know? What do you think the meaning of fear is? The fear is you'll do it or die. It's that simple. In other words, the ways of the animals, I, I identify with more than I do with the ways of the humans. Humans are, are pretty stupid. Humans won't survive. Humans ain't going to survive. Not the way they're going. Think they're going to destroy themselves? Yeah, definitely. They're going to destroy every fucking thing. They're destroying everything. See, people don't realize how many... If you sit down and you started thinking people, it would take you 10 weeks to think up 200 million people, man. Do you know how many people that is? Now, you run out of food with 200 million people. You run out of oil with 200 million people. You run out of thought with 200 million people. You got a lot of meat there, man. That's a lot of meat to deal with, T. You know, I'm reaching for perfection, just like we all reach for perfection. But my perfection is in the air, the water, the trees, and the wildlife. And it goes beyond my physical. You see what I'm saying? In other words, they can't understand. I've already gave this physical up, man. The physical's hanging down there on the courtroom. You know, if you want to interview me, why don't you go talk to the, to the DA? Maybe he can make up some more lies for you, some more stories for you. And here's another thing that you people talk about. All these peace movement, all these demonstrators, they'll run out and demonstrate for a nuclear power plant and turn, go home and turn electricity on. If you want to demonstrate for a nuclear power plant, don't use electricity. <laughs> Does it make sense? You know what I'm saying? They want to demonstrate for something on one hand and get their faces up in the camera and like, look at me, I'm different you know, or pay me to be somebody, you dig? And then on the other hand, they can't be somebody because they go home and turn the fucking electricity on and use the same fucking pollution. You dig what I'm saying? In other words, you can't protest cutting down trees with paperwork. You can't protest pollution riding around in automobiles, you dig? I told you 40 years ago, get back to the horse, man. What's the best way to change things? I get back to the horse. If you don't get back to the horse, there's gonna be nothing left of you. Now, it's dawning in the minds of many it's dawning in the minds of chemistry. It's dawning in the minds of biology. And I got seven big locks in my brain, you dig? And then I send off to Norway. Sure! Uh, and I send them a thought, and it goes to Norway, and the chemistry, and they're looking in their little things, you dig what I'm saying? And then I'm over here in Australia, sitting on a bushman. Uh, I don't need a telephone to, co to communicate with that bushman. You dig ones? That bush man is right inside my soul, man. He's just, he's right inside. I can hear, I can hear everything. I can see through his eyes. You see what I'm saying? It's like I am that bush man.